dear diary this is not about to be our regular weekly vlogs because this week was nothing regular at all this was not a regular week so i'm not about to put up a regular weekly vlog here for you all because this week encompassed a lot this week i've like so much emotions but i just want to address one thing at the beginning of this vlog and that's the fact that insensitivity you don't really know who is insensitive until certain situations happen and you just see that this person is insensitive now tell me why someone will comment that this is god's punishment to a country like why would someone say that this flood i don't just know i i can't i can't comprehend why someone will say that that's just that's just so mean and insensitive you just get to know insensitive people when things like this happen and i just want to commend the government of the uae like the authorities for how they like how they handled the aftermath of this whole thing i started off my week all bubbly and everything and then this happened even when there's no hope you can still go i never answered a no man i still go 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 after my last experience with a nigerian brand that i used their gel for my front hair okay to lay my edges i have not actually searched for a brand that i can use right now i was using I don't want to call the brand name okay because it's not really necessary there was a brand i was using it's a nigerian brand and it was good but then the thing was that i noticed that my front line okay still reacting to that gel so i just stopped using it so i went on tiktok and the girl said we should buy this <laughs> lord please please applying this alone i can already see the hair lifting so i'm heading out now and i'll let you guys know by the time i get back how well this does stay if it's actually worth your money because i'm really 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 searching for something good if you know anything that i can use that's good recommend okay because <laughs> i have a feeling this might not work so i'm back home i got some fresh tomatoes just to walk out please take us for some time before i'm able to go to the farmers markets or vegetable markets red bell peppers I bought some avocado okay I don't eat that but <laughs> the rest of my family does I bought um, white cabbage because I like white cabbage this is for munching my sister asked me to buy this the last time I went to the market but I didn't get it for her so today I just decided to get it she doesn't know that I got it so it's basically like a soap right uh, yeah, I got cotton pads for face toner, more chips. I got carrots for juicing. Carrots have different types, okay? This one is different from this one, and it tastes different actually. I prefer to use this one when juicing and this for cooking or like stew. But this for juicing, perfect. I also use this for cooking, but I prefer it for juicing, okay? <laughs> and then. I also got, I also got one crate of egg. That's basically what I went to buy. Look at them on the floor. So my beans is on fire. I'm actually making bean pottage. I'm not going to show you guys the recipe. <laughs> the thing is, I'm not even a food vlogger. Neither am I a chef. I just love cooking. Like cooking is like a hobby for me, and I do it almost every time. Which is why most of my vlogs, you see one, one, one clip or something of me cooking in the vlogs okay because that's because i enjoy cooking and yeah i do it almost every single time so of course it's going to be in my weekly vlogs because i cook every week so yeah um i had already filmed this after the other <laughs> i was standing in a different spot and i filmed exactly what i'm saying right now but not for word for word okay like i already filmed it and i'm like mm, i don't like this footage i don't like the way the lighting is looking i hate the towels in this kitchen it's very annoying and the light is just in one position so there's not a lot of light coming in so i really 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 do not like it and i'm not one to be carrying like my light everywhere unless when i'm vlogging the food actually but you see my face <laughs> my face is glowing already don't worry you guys manage it like that i probably would have just brought in my light i don't want that heat right now because i'm coming from outside and the heat was hot <laughs> i said the heat was hot it was hot outside and it's not like summer summer in the uae yet but you know we are crossing there so it was hot it was hot anyway this is what the gel is looking like right now okay 
so far so good i notice a lot of products build up if you use a lot of it like it does leave build up that's one thing i've noticed because there's residue it's not like melting into no mm, it's not melting anywhere there's there's build up so that's the first thing that i noticed and the second thing is i can't wear this for like six hours without it going off because i've noticed it's like puffing up this place is laid properly but this side's already puffing up so that's where my stubborn hair is which means this cannot lay my hair flat like flat flat anyway so that's that with that um product i i'm definitely gonna finish it but i'm still like looking out for like a perfect one like something better anyway let me go and cook let me cook this pottage okay i'll show you guys when i'm done but see for now the work that i want to enter hey lord lord help me i'm about to start yeah i'm in a hurry okay so later bye we're heading out when i first moved to the uae this was like one dirhams or one point something now it's like 2.5 i just came here to buy a couple of items i'm almost done but i just want to pick one of these because i like it and i've not had it in a very long time so i just want to treat myself to that At first when I saw these videos making rounds, I thought it was a lie because whenever we have rain, there's always that false video about the flood. Although I could see outside my window that the flood was a lot, I witnessed the rain. I felt my windows shake. I felt my doors shake. But I just, don't, I just couldn't believe that the flood was that bad. And seeing more than one videos represent the same thing, say the same thing, I was so, I was in shock. I was scared for people that were outside how did they cope how did they get home cars were being stopped let's not even talk about people that did not have light people that had no water for like three days after a couple of days i decided to go outside and check out my own environment the roads are not flooded anymore it's like clear everywhere is so clear i think i've worn my money's worth from this hair it's time to put it in the bin because it's sponging up now this is what i was talking about when i said the authorities are working hard and i really admire them for that but let's not forget that there are people that are still living in the flood do not have light and do not have water good afternoon guys how are you everyone i hope all is okay but uh, still our place so, too much people asking me how about my place it's still the same but little going down this the water i hope Tomorrow or after tomorrow it will be okay, but it's still the same water. It's a not good condition, but hopefully soon it will be okay and recover. I, and I hope everyone will be okay. Now with all that said, I've seen constant work and I mean 24-7 work to return the city back to its original state. So I'm giving it a couple of days and I'm sure that everything will be moving smoothly again. And that's one thing that I love about this place. Thanks for watching today's vlog and do not forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.